Howdy ho, boys and girls. Welcome to the channel, Salty Reacts. This is Salty. <laughs> if you're new to the channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. As your family and them, give them a big hug for me. Except the crazy uncle on the back porch. Leave him there. Don't don't even tell him we're doing anything. Don't even tell him the company's coming. You you know what happens every damn time. You just don't say don't say a word. Um, I'm an old geezer. I try my best to react to suggestions, recommendations, etc. Ad infinitum. Um, most of the time I like it. Sometimes I don't. This is what it is. Uh, I talk too much. Sometimes I rewind too much. Sometimes I fast forward and completely miss sections of song. I don't know if that's actually ever happened, but I imagine it will at some point. Uh, and at the end of things, I give the video, the song, every, I don't know if it's the video or the song, usually the song. I give it a rating on my super scientific barbecue scale from zero to 10. It is uber accurate. And everybody argues that it's not, but I think it is. Oh, yeah, I had two beers already. This is number three. Man, I got the burps today. Went, went out for dinner last night and ate way too much. Way too much. Way too much. I had the burps all day. Uh, uh, Italian food, though. Really good. Um, today we're doing samson a quick word this has been recommended and suggested more times than i can count and it took me a minute it's taken me a minute to come back around to samson because uh it, it is uh, uh mm. some of the stuff he has done is just like seared into my mind and the the, the one thing that keeps coming back is that that those pair of scumbags sexually abusing a baby and that oh. so now every time I it says let's do some Samson I get nervous but we're gonna give it a shot today and see, see what we can uh, let's jump over here if you wouldn't mind boys and girls like subscribe comment share hit the dinger button Let's let's get over here to uh, yeah. Let's do some. We're gonna do Star Trek today. A little, a little the bridge of the Enterprise. Mr. Data, um, please, if you wouldn't mind, please engage. <laughs> <coughs> Every night before I go to sleep, I speak to the man that rules above. He helps get me through these trying times. He guides my way and gets me through the mud. As a mortal man, I put my life in your hands. It's funny. It was two days ago. I just, I just did I just did a little sermon thing there a couple of days ago on a on a Tom McDonald song. Uh, we'll get uh, the the Mac Lethal sucks this too. So <laughs> I did a funeral sermon kind of thing. I like this. He's now he's praying. Okay, I gotta start up. I'm sorry. Told you I talk too much. Every night before I go to sleep, I speak to the man that rules above. He helps get me through these trying times. He guides my way and gets me through the mud. As a mortal man, I put my life in your hands because I know you'll do everything to steer me straight. And because of that, a lot of people tell me that I'm wrong and they act like they're right, but it's clear they ain't. They steer your name, but I fear your reign. Some folks don't know how much you sacrificed. And when judgment day comes, they're going to be sorry because they're all going to have to pay a massive price. But I won't because I live for you, no matter how many of my peers doubt me. Every breath I take and every step I make is in your name. That'll never change. Dear Fauci, Easter's... Jesus freak on me or anything like that. I mean, come on, man. <laughs> That's gorgeous. 
much, but I won't, cause I live for you, no matter how many of my peers doubt me, every breath I take and every step I make is in your name, that'll never change, dear Fauci, Easter's coming up, do you think that I could spend it with my loved ones, maybe open up the window, let the wind blow, maybe circulate the air, mix it up some, <laughs> no, I was kidding too, it's just a little joke, I would never disapprove, I already put the chair six feet apart and cut a little hole in my mask, big enough to get my spoon through, yup, yes my lord, vaccine cards are gonna get checked, Have you seen the 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 absolute atrocity of photos that have just been blown all over Facebook and Twitter and everything else? These poor kids. This is like high school kids. They've got the stupid paper mask, and the whole center of the mask is cut out so they can play their musical instruments and in band. Super scientific stuff, you know. Super scientific. Much like my barbecue scale. Shit, my barbecue scale is epic scientific compared to this nonsense we've been dealing with. My mask big enough to get my spoon through. Yup, yes, my lord. Vaccine cards are gonna get checked at the door. I don't care if my brother, my father, my mother doesn't have it. If they don't, they can go next door. They're not welcome at my table. I don't care if you've already had it. There ain't nothing you can tell me. This is fatal. I, ain't I got family that's mental like this. I can say that. It's, it's it's my wife's side of the family. <laughs> she, she's got some. She's got her uh, at least my nephew. I got a couple nephews that are mental, and her sister mental. Oh yeah, mental. Buying into the junk that Trump sold you, chump Fuck your narrative. I'm not gonna help you with your fable. I'm trying to keep my health stable. They don't even have their booster shots. They're my family and I love them to death, but they're gonna kill me if I let them in. Should I do it? Or oh Christ! Yeah, I got two two nieces. that are also mental over this shit. To this day. They don't even have their booster shots. They're my family and I love them to death, but they're gonna kill me if I let them in. Should I do it or not? And my friend keeps trying to convince me that he's fine because he's been vaccinated, but it isn't the same. He only got two shots. That was six months ago. You gotta get free. Now the definition is changed. You better stop bitching because he might need four. Maybe every quarter of the year there might be more. Why would you ask questions at a time like this? I mean, I could loot a Nike store. He's talking about natural immunity. <laughs> hey, but that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Let's let's not let's not look down on people in need. <laughs> Vitamin C and capsules of glutamine, water and exercise, going to the gym and eating healthy, zinc and potassium. Ooh-wee. He probably loves Joe Rogan, <laughs> and that's why his views are inept. I mean, fucking immune system? <laughs> How stupid is that? Oh, shut what up. have we ever relied on those? Yeah, exactly. I don't know. What? Before 2020? Don't be a dummy. You know that was such a long time ago. This is more than the flu. Oh, fucking hell. This is the, this, this is the reason that I've been banned from, from, from Facebook more times than I can count. For pointing out, I don't know, simple things like that. <clears throat> and the fact that, you know, CDC should, well, if you really read the numbers, it's less than 10% of what we said it was. What? Before 2020? Don't be a dummy. You know that was such a long time ago. This is more than the flu, misfortune and doom. This is apples and oranges, a fork and a spoon. Just two different things that you can't even compare. And if you want to go there, you're a moron if you do. <laughs> I know. He probably doesn't watch the news. He probably does his own research. He's a doctor, too. Thinks critically and forms an opinion to the best of his advantage. I mean, I can't even talk. <laughs> Fucking true, man. I... It's so true. They said it on TV, so it's true. It's just, it's just true. His own research. He's a doctor too. Thinks critically, informs an opinion to the best of his advantage. I mean, I can't even talk to you. Have you not seen the SNL skits? Right. <laughs> Rest in hell. <laughs> Piece of shit. Don't even go there. I know you've heard the songs with Stephen Colbert. I know you've seen all of those vaccine musicals on the late night shows. How could you not? And if you don't believe those, I don't think that's what Fauci would want. Huh? Nah. Fuck the AIDS pandemic. You know the ones that kill me are popping up and have popped up over the past couple of years. 
or all the, uh, it's the super overworked uh, first responders in the hospitals and everything able to spend countless hours recording music videos. What's going on? I don't think this what Fauci would want. Huh? Nah, fuck the AIDS pandemic. That was way back in the 80s, man. Forget it. I don't care that you got everything wrong back then, too. This is like way damn different. I remember that horse shit, too. I remember. I remember. Pepperidge Farm remembers. Fauci's a god. He's an absolute abject. Not, he's a moron why and how he has held his position for 40 damn years is astounding. He should have been launched out of a damn circus cannon in the mid 80s and see, it's, hey, can we hit can we hit maybe uh, the midway atoll from I don't know anywhere on the west coast just launch his ass out there and leave him. That F an idiot. I'm willing to give you a second chance and a third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh. Man, I don't like to get into the technical shit. Just tell me how many more injections to get. Data function. That's just Republicans saying some dumb shit. I don't count that. Fuck it. It's not about how many mistakes you make. It's when you make a mistake and how you bounce back from it. And you're real fucking good at that. There's oh, yeah. so many things that have come to light. You could probably do something horrible like kill a dog and nobody would even. Oh, right. I Funny. Y'all recommend y'all suggested this to me. Somebody's gonna be happy when I die of a heart attack listening to Samson. Y'all just go, hey, we finally killed Salty. Like you could probably do something horrible like kill a dog and nobody would even Oh right. I don't mind if you butchered beagles, you can murder my grandma, I wouldn't look at it as evil As long as one of them doesn't do it with their careless actions and maskless, ruthless people It's like folks don't believe in you anymore, all the faith and the trust is gone I don't care that you put hounds six feet deep in the ground, I always root for the underdog Alright, I'm done fucking you, you know what's the terrible thing is? There's a very large swath of the population that realized Fauci was a complete flaming asshole, moron, idiot, waste of space, waste of oxygen 35, 40 years ago. And when we all stood on the mountaintop shouting about it, back then we were told we were idiots and morons, etc. ad infinitum. And here we are again, dealing with this, dare I say, I will dare to say he's a cock knob. He's a complete tool. Around. Insanity is doing the same thing again and again and then expecting a different result. That's not the exact definition of the word. It was Einstein's, but it makes sense, so it holds. Look, if I was your fitness coach and I was giving you routines to get to your goals, but you kept getting fatter and you weren't getting thinner, would you keep paying for me to assist you? No. Or better yet, what if I was your physician and you came to me with a sickness and I'm supposed to fix it and I gave you a bunch of prescriptions and they didn't work over the course of two years? Would you find someone different? Yeah. I think there's a good chance you would. And if you wouldn't, guess what? It's your choice. And that's yep. the good thing about living in America, at least until now, you had a voice. Yep. This has been a pain in the ass for everybody. It's really been a bitch from the start. But how many times you gotta get fucked before you realize they don't have your best <laughs> interests at heart? <laughs> oh my man. Bringing the fire. Christ, I love this kid. I love this kid and I hate this kid. You know what I mean? I know. Is that with barbecue? God damn it. Samson, buddy. You, I love the hair. Because I that that was for the majority of my life. I had that hair. Um hell. Uh actually I I made um party in the back. I made yours look super tame. Super tame. But we'll talk about that another time. I'll see if we can find some pictures. Um, Dagnab. I'm going to give this. What, what do you think, boys and girls? I, I, I think I'm going to go. I think I'm going. 
I think eight and a half. Eight and a half. Eight and three quarters. That was a good that was a good giggle fest. I think I'm gonna do Yeah, I'm gonna do eight and three quarter on that. Some some nice uh uh long and slow uh yeah, some long, slow spare ribs, a mm. couple of fancy sides. Well, well I, you pick your sides. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it your choice on this one. But well, I'm, this is an eight and three quarter. This was really good. A because I hate Fauci. He's a he's a I'm gonna hate that guy. Regardless, you know what? Let's not let's not be hateful. Happy thoughts, happy thoughts, happy thoughts. Barbecues. <laughs> Love you guys. Thanks so much for being here. Like, subscribe, comment, share. More suggestions for Samson. Um, and uh, you know what? I'll see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>